Hi, it's my time to shine. Today was like a real long, hectic day. Oh, gosh. I had to deal with so much ignorance. Um, really with one person. I might as well get into it because the, the thing about it is when you keep um, dwelling on that energy, it's staying around. And I don't want that energy staying around me. So... When people do slick stuff to me, really, you shouldn't do too much stuff to somebody. A regular tarot reader, you shouldn't do stuff to them. But somebody that do tarot readings, witchcraft, voodoo, spells, it's kind of ignorant. And it's kind of simple. Because, like, them people got different type of intuition and different type of intelligence and different type of spells they could do if they really on that type of um situation. People just do and say things that they shouldn't be saying. And sometimes things come back and bite you in your ass. But at the end of the day, I got the um, Jix removal candle um, for everything. Run, devil, run is basically what it's called. Um, and I had to light that. Um, and that's for myself. And in that candle, I put in black salt to keep people away from me in all aspects. Um different oils i don't play no games i don't go back somebody try to do something slick but it's gonna bite them in their ass basically and that's what they get you know when time come but at the end of the day um yes i went on ahead and i ordered i said ordered but you might as well say all that shit they needed i did a zell um far as receiving funds, I didn't hook nothing up where the people could ask me for money. I'm not, I'm not doing that because that's where the scams come in. Um, and I did a cash app. Yeah, finally. I really didn't want to do it. I'm not going to lie um, because I really didn't want to really do it. Like, period. But I had a lot of people come to my email. was like, if you got a cash app, it'd be so better. Um, it take one second. They was like, PayPal, they make you do this. They want you to fill this out. I was like, they make it like easy. They were like, no, it's easy, but it's really not. They was like, but Cash App is different. So I went and got a Cash App, but before I did a Cash App, I had to go, you know, to the bank. Because <laughs> I had to literally talk to an advisor that know about Cash App directly and the scams that I know about. And they was telling me, it was like, well, you're not linking your account far as... Um, people could ask you for money. You're going to take it money. So you're doing the things the backwards way, whereas though the other way, it's, it's a lot of confusion there. Um, the um, banker was telling me about, yeah, it was a lot of scams. But the way you doing it, it's like no scams. And then they was like, this account is nothing else in there. And once your funds get where they go, you take them funds and put them back. An account that's not even linked to neither one, you're fine. But for others that sending money to this person, that person, and people asking for money, that's where the scams come in. And I was like, okay. So, I hooked it up. They already, I already knew to download the app and like they went over the steps with me and told me what to keep off so I don't make them shake I have it on. And then next thing you know, I have somebody ask me for money. If I ever get somebody asking me for money, I have, I have the wrong button on. So they showed me real quick because I really didn't want to get it. So because I got the, um, the cash app, I be forgetting the name of it for the, um, from now until um, Sunday midnight, which will be Monday, because Monday is going to be, I'm always, I'm always going to take Mondays off. Mondays is going to be my off day, unless it's an emergency read, so I could get rest and downtime myself. Just so everybody know, Mondays, if you're coming at me for a read, you're coming at me because you get an emergency read, 105 or $155. That's it. I'm doing emergency read. I'm done. Um, and I still have up to two hours for the emergency read for 155. The other read, I have 12 hours. So Monday I'm off. So let's say that you come at me on Monday and you want an emergency read. You're not going to get that read to Tuesday, even though it was 12 hours. I got to specify things more better because some people, you know, I don't know. They, they, they're not comprehending well, or if your payment don't come through, be as though I'm using cash app, we don't got to worry about a clearance. So if you get with me on Monday and you like, I, I want a reading 
um emergency reading and that's 12 hours that go into monday you're not going to get your reading a tuesday uh, period i'm not doing nothing on monday so if you get in the, the two hour one year and you hit me up on monday i don't do nothing on monday but i might do your read um because it's a two hour read but if you're the 105 read for 12 hours and you hitting me up on sunday and i say it's seven and o'clock in the afternoon or nine at night and i'm already in bed just don't expect your reading to tuesday morning you feel what i'm saying so basically to avoid the co the confusion mondays don't even come at me with a reading on monday because you know that my day off if you're coming at me you're gonna come at me sunday um on my time Pacific Standard Time, I'm going to tell you that much so people, because I've been clashing with a lot of people from California with their time and my time. Um, so, you know what standard I'm on and you be like, oh, all right, it's 8 o'clock here, but it's 8 in the morning there. Then, yeah, I get up and it's Sunday. Yeah, I'm going to do your read Sunday. But if you sending me a message and it's 2 in the morning on my time, you already know how that's going to be. So, that's what I want people to know because I had trouble there a little bit. People want to read in 20 minutes. They 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 need to get a um a tarot read it that's not authentic. They need something fake because that's what they 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 live in an imaginary world. Um, even if it's 12 hours and as with PayPal, and I send you proof, your money don't clear. I'm not doing no reading. Bottom line, no matter what I say, it's about what that money say. I don't care who you is. A lot of people know I wasn't understanding, so I had to send it. And they still was being sarcastic or whatever. I just reversed that back. Talk to the divine and my angels and my little spells and whatever is whatever you want to deal with, what you deal with with a divine throw at you. But I literally not going to have somebody money and not give them a read. And if something, if I give you a read in this time, it's something going on. You know, it'd be better like, are you okay? Um, I didn't get to read or something like that. But don't come at me in a negative form because as I keep telling people, I'm not a regular tarot reader. I'm a fucking real estate broker. What are you talking about? Like, I don't know what you thinking or what, what you live in or what race or none of that you are. But I kind of get the type of people that I be dealing with as well. And I be getting a lot of... um like bisexual men that be coming at me um and i feel it's the feminine part of them and i don't know what you got going on how you treat your significant other but i'm not them bottom fucking lot i'm a woman i act like a woman but i'm gonna show you what a man really about with my masculine energy don't try don't don't do don't no mess with me and if you mess with me in any certain situation and i feel that you messing with my character i will sue you I will literally make sure I get what I get and I'm going to take you to court and I'm going to get all your information because I deal with top lawyers. Like, bottom line, I'm not one of them that just let it go. Oh, you, you messing with my character? Oh, okay. Well, you need to get sued and then I, I need to press charges on you too. So just be mindful that I'm not a normal tarot reader and you need to read in my, you know, about me section and then learn a little bit about who you coming at. Because everybody that do tarot is not um, money hungry. Some people literally is divinely guided and some people is doing this for humanity purpose and really in good spirits. You have people that act like, oh, bad vibes and all this to say this and they're the devil all the way bottom line. So you got to be careful with people. But in the meanwhile, for, you know, the next three days, I'm going to be taking cash app. This is only going to be for people that got cash app. My, um, my specials is going to be for. So if you got cash app, I'm going to, um, do $30 readings. They're not going to be long readings. They're not going to be 30 minutes. They're going to be 15 minutes and under readings. I'm only going to do that for all my cash apps, $25 readings. So only the people that got cash app, if you don't have cash apps, this could just go over your head. Um, at 12 midnight, which is soon, because I'm tired. I've been up doing everything. I've been in states, getting stuff organized. The special wears, though, I told people, you hit my email. You tell me, you know what I mean, I'm special. And a lot of people took advantage of that. And I throw a price at you from cheaper than what I'm already charging. And it's going to be decent. A lot of people took up that offer. So that's why I still got readings till tomorrow. But I'm going to do something for Cash App because a lot of people was telling me and cry by cash app so all my cash app individuals um i'm going to do um 25 readings for all 
Cash App only. Only Cash App. If you don't have Cash App, this definitely not flying with you. And everybody else is going to be regular. Um, I'm still dealing with PayPal, but PayPal like is just be a little complication when you got fraud people. So it's like I got other means. But PayPal I love because it secure me, but also PayPal take up for other people sometimes and you gotta deal with that situation as well. So with them, I that's why I got all receipts now. Everything's gonna be receipt, especially with PayPal, and it probably is gonna be a little something with it. But I'm going to deal with it. But if you got Cash App, because a lot of people are like, I got Cash App. I got Zelly. And I'd rather use that. If you got any of that, and then you don't got to worry about your payments pending. And I'm not saying that, you know, PayPal bad, because I'm going to still be using PayPal. You feel me? But I, I'm going to use something, too, that's quick for everybody as well. So, um, $25 reads for all my Cash Apps. 15 minutes and under. You can ask me about three questions with that. And um, I'm going to just do a read. Or you don't even have to ask me three questions. I'm just going to read. Just read. I just need your um, name and your birthday. You can reach me at my email in the About Me section. A lot of people keep saying they can't find my email. I don't see how. When you go to the About Me section, you scroll all the way down. You're going to see links for PayPal. You're going to see Cash App link. And you're going to see View Email for business inquiries. It's right there. And you could just, you know, send me, you know, your day of birth. I don't know how Cash App work yet because I didn't get nobody to send me money yet. So I don't know if you allowed to send a message or anything so if not you just still go through the email so i'm gonna do a reading i'm not doing too many i'm doing like one or two readings for the entire i've been busting my ass honestly i did one two three four five six seven eight nine ten eleven twelve thirteen fourteen fifteen sixteen seventeen eighteen i did 18 readings since i came home at four o'clock and four candles that I still got to do, which that's always a little extra time. And I still got three readings left. So, yeah, I'm doing two readings. See what's the energy um, around. And I'm I'm done for the night. And I'm about to eat. And I'm just going to head to bed. And anybody that um do the cash app or anything like that, all you got to do is go to my email. Put your cash nap at name. I need to know that even if you want to screenshot it and put your date of birth. And your name is all I need. You need your full name, not the Cash App name. I need your full name, which usually is on the Cash App I'm seeing. And your date of birth and your readings will be to you. I will need up to 48 hours because you see what I'm doing. So your readings will be to you by Sunday because, like I said, Mondays I'm off. So I'm, I'm sticking with that. I need, Monday got to be off. I know people are like, damn, Sunday would be better. No, Monday because Monday is the better day for me. Because it's like, I got, it's just better. It's like an extra lounging day and all that after Sunday. So, Mondays I'm off. Um, I'm only open for emergency reads for Monday. And that's if you get them in by 7 p.m. Standard Eastern Time on Sunday. Then you'll have your read and because it's going to be done because Mondays I'm off. When 12 midnight hit, it's over. I, bottom line, you will have to get your read on Tuesday. So I just want you to know, especially if you after the 7 p.m. cut time so I can have my time. So, like I said, $25 reads for only cash app for the next three days. It ends Sunday at midnight. Bottom line. And I need 48 hours. So let's say you do it today. You give me the Sunday. Like Sunday, I'll probably be doing a lot of reads. Is what I'm saying. If I don't feel like doing a lot tomorrow. It depends how many customers I get. I appreciate you guys. I appreciate your views, your subscribes, your dislike. I really appreciate it. And I wish abundance for everybody. Even the liars, the haters, the manipulators, the scammers, the devils. At the end of the day, divine always deal with those type of people. And you get no good luck in your life when you do that. So you really should change your life. Bottom line, race don't matter. None of that matter. Religion matter. When you a snake, you a snake. And the divine will deal with you. So with that being said, I'm going to see the overall energy. And then I just want to move forward. Yeah, somebody's watching you. Could be me. Somebody watching you. Somebody could be stalking you. This is somebody that thinks they got a quick mind. This could indicate trouble with the police as well. I feel as though somebody got a stalker, Gemini, Libra, Aquarius energy. 
Um, you may have one. I feel as though that I'll be having a couple. But, you know. Universe, spirit, guides. Wow, that was a lot of cards. Universe, spirit, guides, holy angel. What is the energy surrounding this read? Okay. What is the energy? Great, right on time, basically. Okay. What I see here is the divine is telling somebody they need a cup of love. He's offering somebody a cup of love. Um, this could be um, to love yourself. You know, some things people do, they're not loving their self. They're acting like they are. And divine is giving you a cup of love. I don't know if you're going to accept it. That's in the past. In the present, somebody did not want to turn their back on a situation. Their emotions is all over the place, which is not a good um, situation that's um, Scorpio Pisces cancer in the near future somebody's getting judgment over a situation which is a good card um, that's judgment from the divine for what people do crazy it came out like this but that's how it go we have the four of wands um, this is like some celebration some happiness Um, this could be a new beginning in a marriage um, a union a engagement Sagittarius Aries Leo energy um, at the nine of pinnacle, somebody is not comfortable at this time, um, or they're coming up out of being comfortable. And with the nine of swords as well, that's crazy. That's the eight. Wait, wait, wait. Somebody should look up 99, break it down, and look up the angel number. This is somebody in their brain that got self sabotage. Um, they stressing, they got anxiety, they going through a lot. Um, Gemini, Libra, Aquarius energy, that's the overall energy here with somebody not comfortable. And like with anxiety, nightmares, and worry, you ain't comfortable. So you may want to um, get some help if that's you. That's the overall energy. But I'm going to go ahead and I'm going to see what's going on here. Because it's like somebody didn't take divine love. Because he was saying, leave something. Yeah. Somebody from your past is coming back to your life is what I'm seeing. Or you reminiscing about your past. Um, this could be a Scorpio Pisces Cancer. They ain't here heavy. Yeah. Somebody from your past is coming back. But you know how I say about the past. What is the energy surrounding this read at this time? What is the energy? Okay. Bottom of the deck. There's no movement. And good luck is on your side, the will in your favor. And there's somebody watching you. Like this came out again. Somebody is watching you. It could be for good reason. Somebody is watching you. Yeah, they watching you. They they thinking about some shit. And this could indicate police trouble for somebody. You got to be careful. That's the energy. Somebody emotions is all over the place. And the confusion wrapped around them. You could be dealing with a Scorpio Pisces cancer. Somebody is upset or something. Somebody from the past. Because someone was building a faulty foundation. This is that way. And you had to start from the bottom to the top. Or they had to. But somebody is like really, really watching you. Like somebody from your past. They don't want to turn their back on the situation that y'all may have had or friendship. We're going to see. Because this, what is the energy? Yeah, like the will is in your favor for your present energy. Like it's like you just, everything that don't mean no good is just falling to the wayside. And that's from the divine. Yeah, something is telling me to tell you to stay to yourself, keep your money to yourself, and keep your business to yourself. Capricorn Taurus verbal energy. It's somebody around you that that that's or somebody that's that's stalking you. I feel they stalking you. That's that's from your past. That's very jealous of you. Yeah, they may be telling even lies about you. Somebody is. Yeah, let's see the judgment for the near future. Yeah, somebody can't make something happen with you. Sagittarius, Aries, Leo. They're very jealous. Yeah, you ended something permanently with them and because of lies. And they is upset. You could be dealing with a Gemini, Libra, Aquarius. It could be a woman as well. Sagittarius, Aries, Leo. Like, yeah, somebody is like at a crossroads, like blind. Like, they can't believe something. Yeah. 
Yeah, but the Knight of Rods, yeah, somebody trying to do something, make something happen fast, near future. Sagittarius, Aries, Leo, somebody on something slick. Somebody you didn't want to build something with. Capricorn, Taurus, Virgo, they see all you doing is working and making your money, and you not taking no more chances with them. Maybe in some type of um relationship or something but somebody around you is really jealous and they watching you like double fold so i think you keep your money keep your business to yourself and and, and stay to yourself more if you're doing it already then you know hooray but don't don't slip don't slip yeah, because it's somebody jealous. Could be a woman as well with lies. Somebody could be lying to you. Yeah, like somebody is stalking you from afar. Their emotions are all over the place. But the divine gave you a uh, gave you energy to cut them off with truth and clarity. Yeah, somebody is jealous of you. And they plotting. That's what I get. Gemini, Libra, Aquarius, you got to be careful. And then somebody thought they had the whole world with you. It's the energy for the future. Yeah. You're going to get everything you wish your hope for, Aquarius energy. You're going to get a new beginning in your finances. Somebody had a fell victory with you, Sagittarius, Aries, and Leo, and they is so upset. This could be somebody that came, just came out of jail, or they come out of jail to make something happen, or they in jail in their mind. Sagittarius, Aries, Leo. Yeah, you could be dealing with an Aries as well. Yeah, some secret school will be coming out about them, or it did. Scorpio Pisces, somebody got a lot of burdens. Somebody see you and look at you as burdens. Like they're jealous. Like real rat. Yeah, you got you got some things going on that you don't see right now. Um, I need you to be careful. They plotting on something that that that's not gonna come to fruitation. What is the energy? That's why I wanted to get to my readings. Yeah, the seven of pentacles reversed. There's somebody's attention is supposed to be on something else when it's on you. And that's why their money low. This is somebody money that's low, that's stressing. Yeah, somebody that had you in a third party that wasn't given and taken in the relationship. This is what I'm seeing right now. Like, I don't like this energy. Yeah. Bottom of the deck, yeah, you would rest retreat in and praying. You may rest retreat and pray for this person. You must you went into a hermit mode basically because you're coming up out of confusion. You must have a lot of confusion with this person. They was trying to offer some fake ass love. Yeah. Queen of Cups, you could be dealing with a woman as well. Yeah, some odd, this could be you coming up out of being stuck in a situation and you cut somebody off. Gemini, Libra, Aquarius, energy. Yeah, that's the energy. You need to be careful. Um, Somebody is stalking you. Heavy. Like, so heavy. They trying to think about all types of ways to get to you, to, like, make you miserable with them. I don't know who this is. You got women and you got a man here. It could be two people. I don't like it. I just be writing stuff down. Um, I take heed when I do my own readings as well. Because I already know what's going on. I'm about to check my food. I put it real low though. So. I'm about to do reading. And I'm, I'm, gonna, I'm relaxing. Now my stomach turning. Of the energy. Hey. What is the energy surrounding this reading? I need to focus on my healing. Yeah, this is somebody that hurt you in the past as well as I'm seeing here. And I know I made a mistake. They feel like they made a mistake and um you want to focus on your healing. You may not be speaking to this person right now. But I feel as though they want to make contact or they make contact with you, but you don't know it's them is what I'm seeing. So be careful with anything. That's why I went and got me what I got me today and new dummy numbers. What is the energy? Wow. All them cards fell. But the one that come out that, uh, that I took. Is the four of pentacles. That's the one that tell you to stay alone. Stay alone. Keep business confidential. Yeah. And it got on the back Capricorn. That's crazy. You got this twice. It's saying stay to yourself. Like some somebody ain't right. Yeah, somebody ain't right. Somebody ain't right. 
<clears throat> Stay to yourself. Keep your business to yourself. There's something going on that you don't know about right now. What is the energy? Damn, they all try to come out. What's the energy surrounding this read? Universe? Spirit guide? What's the energy? That's too many. What's the energy? Universe, spirit guide, holy angel. What's the energy surrounding this reading at this time? Okay. Somebody wants what you have. Yeah. I just told you that. Somebody want what you what what somebody want want what you have. Yeah. And they trying to like I don't know what kind of plot is going on. It's not gonna come to fruitation, but Somebody trying trying something. They could be trying to do anything. Change your passwords all the time. Because I do. I change my passwords like twice a month. Some shit I be forgetting. Change your passwords. Don't trust nobody. Keep your business to yourself. Certain shit just don't mention. What is the energy surrounding this reading at this time? I can't wait to hit my bed. What's the energy? Too many cards. I'm going to take the first two that came out. This kitten is a Persian. <laughs> take how I resonate the rest. Because I know what I meant when I did that one. And reach to the stars. Yeah. Somebody might be in love with your vagina. And they see that you reach into the stars with your dreams. That could be a reason why somebody hating me. Because I see a male and a female. I don't just see a, a male um or just a female i see a male and a female that's jealous and they just trying to figure something out but they ain't gonna get no good luck in it anyway so don't worry about that or stress your head and be like i wonder who the, the fuck who fuck them and move forward you feel me peace light and blessings